Hey everybody, this is So Heidi, and this tutorial is part of a larger series showing different techniques for drawing fashion flats in Illustrator. This technique is using Pathfinder Divide. So what I've done is I've drawn the outline of my garment as one continuous path, and I've drawn overlapping paths where I want to cut my garment into separate shapes. This works great not just for armholes, but also for color block panels. So I'll just add one more here. And what I want to demonstrate is that you specifically want to use a path that has got no fill color, so just a stroke, and it needs to extend beyond both edges of the garment. We'll go ahead and reflect this one across the center front. And now what I want to do is I want to select the outline of my garment as well as all of the overlapping paths that I want to use to cut separate shapes out of my garment. And using the Pathfinder panel, I want to choose Divide. What that's going to do is it's going to divide the underlying shape, which is my t-shirt, into separate shapes where there are overlapping paths. So I click on that and you can see, now we've just got um, some ranging issues, I'll send that to the back. What I've got here is now um, a grouped object that consists of essentially one, two, three, four, five different shapes. And we'll just go ahead and ungroup that. So I, you can see now I've got these panels broken into separate shapes. So if I want to color these separately or fill them with patterns and manipulate the patterns independently, I have the ability to do so. This is a great technique. One of the downfalls that I find is that if I later need to come back and manipulate the curvature of this, I'm stuck having to manipulate the curvature of two separate paths. Um, so unless I know that my paths are for sure correct the very first time around, it doesn't allow a lot of flexibility for changing them afterwards. Go ahead and watch the other three tutorials and see if there's a technique that works better for you. Thanks for watching. This is So Heidi.